actually. So there are days that it's quite tiring, but yeah, it's okay. How about you? How was your day? How was your week? <laughs> yes. Uh, all right. So anyway, Chen, uh, did you have dinner? Did you eat? Yes, important. How about you? <laughs> I'm done. I had dinner. I had dinner and I look really fat right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I because I keep on eating. Okay, anyway, so <laughs> okay, let's start. My yeah. gosh. So last time, okay. Mm, we're done with I think oh I forgot where we stopped last time, but I think mm -hmm. yeah, I so we're think... going to have five five point one. Yes, this part. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Yes, I remember in the, the, the about mm -hmm. about letter A, we finished yes. in the last meeting. Mm -hmm. All right. So for this one, so this is Alan, and so you're going to listen about yeah. So dealing with stress. So Chen, how do you deal with stress? <laughs> so, <laughs> So for me, I always, if I'm stressed, I always buy or eat something nice. So yeah, like that. And for this one, Alan Bradshaw is a director of In Equilibrium. Okay, so he's a director of this one. So In Equilibrium is a stress management consultancy. Oh, so he's a consultant. Listen to the first part of the interview and complete these notes. So Chen, if you are stressed, you can go to Alan's office and <laughs> have a consultation. <laughs> Joke. Okay, anyway, so let, let me play the audio. Unit 5. All right, so can you hear the audio clearly? Yeah, I need to find a paper. I, uh, okay. I, I left my yes. book in the... <laughs> <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. uh, okay. <laughs> wow, that's quite uh it's a oh a whole paper. Okay. So you are really ready. <laughs> you are prepared. <laughs> okay. So is it okay right now? Let's play the audio. Yes, okay. Okay, let's start. Stress. Recording 5.1. What are the most common causes of stress at work? Well, usually it's a combination of things uh, rather than one cause. Uh, some combinations are worse than others. Uh, for example, a very bad combination is where someone is under a lot of pressure, but they also feel that they have no control and they feel unsupported. That combination can cause severe stress and depression. People in that situation often feel helpless, but nothing they can do will make any difference. And that's a very bad feeling. All right, so did you hear the answer? <laughs> yes. Yeah. No worries, I, because we can play the audio again. Yes, yes but I need to read it a little bit first. Ah, oh, yes, I'm sorry. First is oh, we no, need no, to no. read and then listening. I, I forgot, Chen. <laughs> yes, oh, okay, yes, so please clear. read it silently. <laughs> I forgot that we have to read it first. Okay, so you, after reading silently, please let, uh, let me know so we can play the audio. Yeah, I can, I can. All right. So now let's. Mm -hmm. 
Unit 5. Stress. Recording 5.1. What are the most common causes of stress at work? Well, usually it's a combination of things uh, rather than one cause. Uh, some combinations are worse than others. Uh, for example, a very bad combination is where someone is under a lot of pressure, but they also feel that they have no control and they feel unsupported. That combination can cause severe stress and depression. People in that situation often feel helpless, that nothing they can do will make any difference. And that's a very bad feeling. Mm -hmm. So were you able to get the answers? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I need to uh, one more time. <laughs> OK. All right, here. Unit 5. Stress. Recording 5.1. What are the most common causes of stress at work? Well, usually it's a combination of things uh, rather than one cause. Uh, some combinations are worse than others. Uh, for example, a very bad combination is where someone is under a lot of pressure but they also feel that they have no control and they feel unsupported. That combination can cause severe stress and depression. People in that situation often feel helpless, that nothing they can do will make any difference. And that's a very bad feeling. Mm. All right, so how was it? <laughs> you have um, yeah, for the last time. <laughs> mm. Yes, it's okay. It's actually okay. So in order for you to uh, get the the words, yes, or the answers right here. Unit 5. Stress. Recording 5.1. What are the most common causes of stress at work? Well, usually it's a combination of things uh, rather than one cause. Uh, some combinations are worse than others. Uh, for example, a very bad combination is where someone is under a lot of pressure, but they also feel that they have no control and they feel unsupported. That combination can cause severe stress and depression. People in that situation often feel helpless that nothing they can do will make any difference. And that's a very bad feeling. Uh -huh. okay. So, how was it? Okay. <laughs> um, Are you sure it's okay? Yes, I can, I can. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so before we start, Chen, I would like to ask you, what is, do you know this word, the meaning of this word? I don't equi equilibrium. Equilibrium. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Not 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 yet. I mm -hmm. but uh, because uh, the word equi equi is uh, the balance. Not common. Uh, yes. Yes. It's yeah. balance. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So Very good. Yes. Yeah. Equilibrium. Very good. Yeah. It mm. will be. Maybe in the uh, in the center in the company that uh, that will have a customer to to make a, 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 a balance in in the in the life. I think so. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yes, of course. Yes. So actually, you're right. Balance. So yes, that's the uh the main word. Balance. So wow, you're right. So, but we don't really use this word, right? Uh, rather than using equilibrium, we use the word balance. So only, I think, few people know about this. But anyway, so um, are you ready for this? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, so uh, reading and answering. Okay, so please read and answer. The most common cause of stress. Is usually a combination of things mm -hmm. rather than one cause. 
rather than I hear one cow. <laughs> I, 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 I I cannot uh, yeah. what is it? One 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 cow. Uh, oh. Cause one cause oh, yes, causes. Yes, no. yes, effect and cause. So like this one. So it's not just uh, okay here. Combination rather than one cause causes or yeah. cause. so yes, it's a combination. All right. So next, please read an answer. Yeah. For example, a very bad combination is where someone is under a lot of pressure. Mm, very good. So. Under a lot of pressure. How about you, Chen? Are you under a lot of pressure right now regarding your work? Yeah, uh, usually. <laughs> yes, uh, <laughs> usually. Uh, uh, a mm. new, uh, new, uh, uh, how I can say, uh, my uh, department is a new mm. head in the company. Yes, so uh. everything uh, we have to set up uh, uh, in at, at uh, everything for, 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 for oh my gosh yeah. so you it's like back to zero you have to start from the very beginning like, oh new management new head right so new policy or something like that rules oh i hope it's okay for you <laughs> it's going to be okay for you yeah. okay so anyway okay let's continue but, uh, but they also feel that they have no control Control. Control. Mm -hmm. They have and no control. control. Yeah, it's normal when we when we are you know under pressure, we can't control our uh, emotion or feelings. It's yeah, I think it's normal. Okay, and feel yes, unsupported. So do you feel this sometimes? Do you feel this sometimes? But uh, I mean, you know, you're working. You're working, so do you feel under pressure? And also, sometimes you can feel that uh, you can get mad easily. You can't control your feelings or emotions. Have you experienced mm. that one? Mm. For me, I think I uh, I not yet in the in, mm. in this situation. So if you are so stressful and it's very stressful. I mm -hmm. have sometimes I have stress, but uh, the, the the level uh, the grade is not very high. It's like uh, in, in, middle. in so the middle. So only feel yeah yeah feel uh, tired. Uh, need mm. to feel Sleep sleeping and relax. Yes, yeah, mm. relax only. Yeah, uh, mm. yeah uh, <laughs> and lose lose of concern. Yeah. <laughs> <Not just> yes. <laughs> <me. laughs> <laughs> All right. So I think there are some people when they are stressed, they will get mad easily. I've tried it, you know, when uh sometimes not not uh always, just sometimes when I'm stressed, so I get mad easily. <laughs> So yeah, yeah, yeah but maybe. just sometimes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Anyway, so all right, let's continue. Please read an answer. Yes. That combination can cause several, several, several. How I can? Several. Fever stress. Yeah. Fever. Like. Fever. Fever stress. Fever mm -hmm. stress. And. Depression. Okay, I depression. Think. Severe stress is like, you know, it's like intense, severe headache, intense, or yeah, something like that. So, depression. Okay. People in, people in that situation often feel that nothing they can do will make any difference and that a very bad feeling. Mm -hmm. uh, I will any difference. Okay. Any difference. So there are actually 
for some people it's just you know there's two ways sometimes they will get mad or sometimes they will feel like they don't want to work anymore they don't want to wake up eat or even uh take a bath so sometimes they just feel you know i don't want to do anything anymore they feel tired yeah okay so thank you for uh doing this activity and now let's move on to the second part of the interview all right so before we start listening <laughs> okay yeah. please read the question silently oh sorry uh where is it okay it's 30 it's 31 29 Yes. So your ma main goal is to find out in what ways, main yes. ways. Okay. Okay. I will listen. Continue. <laughs> All right, so I will play the audio now. Recording 5.2. How do you help companies to deal with stress? Well, we help in two main ways. Uh, firstly, by investigating causes of stress, what we call stress risk assessment. The idea of this is to identify problem areas and or groups hotspots where the risk of stress is high. Secondly, we train managers by raising their awareness of stress and giving them skills to prevent and reduce stress at work. Mm -hmm. So let's let's try to okay. listen again. Yeah, please. Recording 5.2. How do you help companies to deal with stress? Well, we help in two main ways. Uh, firstly, by investigating causes of stress, what we call stress risk assessment. The idea of this is to identify problem areas and or groups, hotspots where the risk of stress is high. Secondly, we train managers by raising their awareness of stress and giving them skills to prevent and reduce stress at work. Mm -hmm. So how was it? I can play by myself in the, in the first, uh, first way. Uh, mm -hmm. I hear about the, the Alan. Uh, Alan. That's so, maybe. Mm -hmm. Yes, it tell the in the first way you need to find the the the, the reason uh, that uh, rise the stress and uh, and after uh, find out uh, how to rescue mm -hmm. the the the, the, yes, the reason and for second. For a certain way, the uh, chance in the manager uh, who might the uh, step on uh, is increase. In the work. Yes, like decrease. That. Okay, so do you want to add more or that's it? Yeah, maybe I need to listen again <laughs> for, mm -hmm. uh, for my, uh, yeah, enough, enough. The uh, second, mm -hmm. the uh, second for, part? I think I think for one. Uh, okay. Recording 5.2. How do you help companies to deal with stress? Well, we help in two main ways. Uh, firstly, by investigating causes of stress, what we call stress risk assessment. The idea of this is to identify problem areas and or groups, hotspots, where the risk of stress is high. Secondly, we train managers by raising their awareness of stress and giving them skills to prevent and reduce stress at work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. In the 
in the first place uh, for clearly for more clearly mm, more clear i can say uh, something more like uh, the first the first way is the, uh, they uh, they need to to find the Mm, I can hear yeah. what the I after find that the now. Cause. <laughs> find yeah. the cause. Find the cause. Yeah. Investigation cause. Yeah. Mm. Uh, mm, have to find the problem in where uh, and uh, yes. Yes. And, uh, mm, mm, mm. Hmm. And find the way to rescue. Mm -hmm. so, yes. So it's finding out or investigate or investigating the causes of stress. So that's what we call they have a test. So it's like um, stress, rest. Uh, assessment. So they're going to assess the person and what they feel, like how you feel right now, or do you always feel this way, like that. So, and for the second part, just like what you mentioned uh, about manager, yes. So regarding workplace, it's important to, so they train managers right so managers by raising their concern or awareness yeah. so to reduce um by raising their concern or awareness to reduce or decrease just like what you've mentioned Ah, ah, reduce, uh, mm, uh, reduce or uh, decrease uh, stress. At work. So I think in how about in your company, Chen? Do you have something like this? Like, um, because your company is quite big, right? So are there any uh training like personal training like yeah. this one? Like they have to uh, train the managers to handle yeah. their colleagues if they're stressed. Yeah, yeah. Have, my company uh, sometimes has uh, uh, some some call and uh, the the manage, managing director mm -hmm. some tend to tend to the manager personnel for the training call. About the managing, managing course. So that's, yeah. I think it's, but not all the companies in Vietnam, right? Not all. Yes, not or, uh, Yeah, uh, from, because some. From the man manager of, a department, of, of one department, a higher, not mm. uh, on. <laughs> because I think in Philippines, not really that. You know, because it's different. Men mental and emotional health is important in order to continue working, right? But if your employees are stressed, so they cannot function or work properly. So in Philippines, we don't really, I think there are some, but yeah, it's just really rare. So thank you for this one, yeah. for your answer. And you still, <laughs> it's only a little time uh -huh. left. On. Yeah, so that's it. And have this yeah. one next meeting okay so that's it for tonight Chen, and thank you so much for joining our class and don't be stressed don't be stressed yeah, I will okay. sleep, uh, yeah. yeah yes bye have a good night yeah. okay thank you, thank you. <laughs> bye